Hey everybody, this is Big Jason of Big Marketing at BigMarketingOnline.com and Better Email Deliverability Guaranteed at BetterEmailDeliverability.com. This is the AWeber Custom Form Tutorial with Opt-in Rate Tracking. Alright, so the problem is, is that a lot of people want to use custom HTML with their AWeber opt-in form, but they also want to track their opt-in rate. And this is the code that you usually get. Okay, here's what we're going to do. Going to leave that there, but we're going to surround it with a div statement and a style. Div style equals quote display colon none semicolon question mark greater than. Then we're going to close it. The closing. Okay, basically what we said is we want to hide this. It's still going to execute, it's go, still going to track the opt-in rate, but it's going to be hidden from view. And now we want to use our custom HTML with special PHP code sometimes, with, sometimes with special submit buttons, whatever you want. Now you can do that. There you go. This is uh, successful.com Alejandro Reyes blog. I'm going to update his sidebar PHP. Works for wherever you have your opt in form. Under list settings in the web form. If you haven't tracked your opt in rate before and you've got some miscellaneous information, you want to go ahead and reset it. If you've been tracking it accurately before, you want to leave it alone. Just going to reset it. All right. Now Alejandro is good to go. He's got his custom HTML, custom submit button, and he's tracking his opt in rate. And just in case you don't know where to get the HTML from AWeber, see, this is the HTML where you can put in your custom code, and this is what you need to have for the opt-in rate tracking. So you got both. Hopefully that helped you. And this is Big Jason of Big Marketing at BigMarketingOnline.com and Better Email Deliverability Guaranteed at BetterEmailDeliverability.com. We'll see you soon.